Hello, beer tubers. Welcome to yet another beer review with me, Peter, the Master of Hoppets. And today, guys, we're going to be looking at a beer from New Belgium Brewing Company, their flagship beer, by the way. Uh, New Belgium Brewing Company out of Fort Collins, Colorado. This is their Fat Tire Amber Ale. It's an Amber Ale on 5.2% alcohol. It says here on the side, Fat Tire Amber Ale's appeal is in its feet of balance. Toasty biscuit night malt flavors, coasting in equilibrium with hoppy freshness. Named in honor of a storied bike ride through Europe, Fat Tire cruises with Belgian imagination and inspiration. Take it for a ride. And uh, yeah, this is their flagship beer, as I said. Um, I've had this already a couple of times over here because it's you see it everywhere on the bar in the bars and all. It's a pretty okay solid amber ale. But I got a 12 pack, a mixed pack, or of uh, New Belgian beers where this was in their Ranger IPA. Triple and I think it's called Winter Ale, which I'm gonna review for you guys. Um, yeah, and I thought I'd start off with the fact of beer. So yeah, guys, let's just get it cracked open and uh, dig into to it. Okay, so we got the fat tire poured here, and it is actually kind of light for an amber ale. It is a light amber, kind of orange-like color. It's got a one finger off, I don't know, it's more like just a regular white head, maybe the nightly off-white. But uh, yeah, let's check out the aroma. Definitely the toasted malts and caramel notes, and some grassy hops, some citrus, a little bit of pineiness. But mostly, it's, it's very mild in the aroma. Mostly, you get the kind of toasted maltiness. It smells pretty all right. Yeah, kind of wants a sweet biscuity kind of sweet malty aroma to it too. It smells very all right. So uh, let's give it a taste. Cheers, guys. Yeah, it's pretty all right. It's definitely not the best amber ale you can get. You can get much better, much, much better. And the other beers I have from, from them to review, I prefer much more. I like, it's like a little 12 pack, had four different beers and then three of each. And uh, I prefer the three others. But this is a salt, still solid. I'd rather drink this than the light beers. <laughs> but yeah, I think it was like 12 bucks for the 12 pack, which is really cheap. Um, it's a winter mix pack that I got. But yeah, uh, flavors in there, the body on this, it's light, and me light to medium, lightly dry. Flavors in there, the toasted malt is right away, sweet caramel malt too. Some lightly biscuity, bready notes. The hops aren't that big though. It's The hop flavor in there is kind of like that sweet, citru lightly citrusy flavor, some grassy notes, a little bit of pine. That's it. It's a kind of one-sided beer, but it's a session beer. It's a real session beer. You can easily drink a lot of this. Uh, but I prefer the others in their mix pack. And I also get a couple of their beers from their uh, Lips of Faith series. I think it's the Super Crew, which is like a s bigger version of this. And uh, Prickly Saison. That's the ones I get currently. But this is an okay beer. Rating-wise for the Fat Tire from New Belgium. I'm gonna give it a 60. It's an above average beer. Not really anything to jump for joy about. I mean, if you go out and this is one of the beers that's only on tap, I'd definitely go for that. If it's craft beer they have, because I'd rather drink this than like the light beers. Um, but yeah, guys, stay tuned for the reviews of the other New Belgian beers, because they are better than this. Uh, so yeah, guys, that does it for this beer review. Remember to let me know what you think about the New Belgium Fat Tire Amber Ale, if you've had it. As always, remember to comment, subscribe, check out the Facebook fan page and Twitter. And I'm going to say cheers, guys. And I'm going to see you in another video review.